<laughs> oh my gosh, it's been a while since I've done that. Why do I think I'm so dang hilarious today? I don't... Alright you guys, before we get into this video, we are going back to one of the older custom scooter builds. A lot of people have asked me to go to the cinematic things again, so that's what this video is going to be. If you guys want me to go back to the cinematic custom scooter builds, then let's get this video to 2 billion likes! And also, one more thing. Want to get your comment pinged? Up oh, Batman! Then what you guys gotta do right now, go in the comment section and comment the funniest thing, tag your Instagram, and the one who gets a comment pinned slash the funniest thing, I will go to your Instagram and follow you on my Instagram, which is Steam Garlotte. Or down in the description. I like funny jokes. Alright, that's enough of me talking. Let's get into the custom scooter build. Oh, I made you guys think, didn't I? Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to today's video. I hope you guys did like the cinematic custom scooter builds because I love making them. They just take forever to edit. But anything where you got a lot of gangers. I can't wink. I swear, when I try to wink, I try to like, I like blink both eyes like I don't get it. All right, you guys, so we have someone very special here while we're interrupting this video because he's got something to surprise me with. I have no idea. Can you guys guess who it is? Yeah, apparently he has a package for me, so we'll see. Hey! Stay hydrated. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Stay hydrated. Oh surprise, surprise. I care so much about you. I bring you water. Thanks, bro. I appreciate I, I it. I appreciate it. You also uh, tried to bring it to the bar. Appreciate you. Alright, All right, so we're going to start off with the bars. So for the bars, what we have, we have NV charge bars. These were Max Peter's old signature bars before they made the V3s, which um, are no longer being made anymore. These bars run about like... 60 bucks. They are made with a 6061 aluminum and they come in black with the nice little charge logo on it. Next we have the Havoc Descendant deck. This deck comes 21 inches long and 4.75 inches wide. It's actually a pretty light deck. This deck runs about $120. And then the next thing that we have, we have the NVTPR grips. These are the V3s in black and white splatter paint. British splatter. <laughs> That's what they're called, British splatter. Next we have the Proto Fade in pink. These are the grippers, not sliders. The sliders come in like a pinkish purple type of color. These run about 80 bucks. Next, we have the Root Industries Air Bubble Clamp in chrome. And then we have an Apex headset and an NVCNC fork to go on this build. Let's weigh all these parts and see how light they are and how light the scooter is going to be. Alright, so the NVTPR grips weigh about... Let it doesn't matter. Proto grippers weigh one pound and one ounce. Almost two though. Root Industry Air Clamp weighs about 4.8 ounces. The Apex headset 
weighs two pounds and two ounces. The Apex headset weighs about 2.2 ounces. The NV CNC fork weighs 12 ounces. It weighs 12.6 ounces. NV charge bars, two pounds, 0.23 ounces. All right, so this is the thing that I'm most all right, so this is the thing that I'm most excited about is the Havoc Descendant deck. It feels fairly light to me, so I'm very interested to see how light it is. Three pounds and 7.4 ounces. So I would actually be really down to try out this deck. So if you guys want to see me test this deck, or also, if you know, you have it, you want to DM me. We can work something out. Come on. We can... All right, anyways, you guys, let's start putting the suitor together and see what it looks like. This thing looks amazing. I am so happy with how it turned out. I say that in every single video. I don't think I've ever been not happy with how a scooter turned out unless it was the world's uh, worst, best scooter. Yeah. But anyways, if you guys want to see more custom scooter builds, of course, give this video a big thumbs up. And also, all right, guys, but thank you guys very much for watching this custom scooter build. And I have a lot of great news and I'm going to be announcing that in tomorrow's video. If you went to a normal scooter shop, this would be around $407 before tax. But if you buy it here at this scooter zone, this scooter will only run you about $295. And this scooter, so it's an extremely cost-effective custom complete, and I hope you guys did enjoy it. I'm gonna show you guys how heavy the scooter is, and then we're gonna get going. This scooter weighs about eight pounds, eight pounds even. Whoa, why is it going down? So that scooter is eight pounds even, it has the proto wheels, which add a little bit of weight. The root industries clamp, which adds a little bit of weight. But you do get a full custom complete for around $295. And just look at the sick graphic on the bottom. Oh my gosh. But anyways, you guys, like I said before, this scooter is a full custom complete. Super dial. And you can only get it at Scooter Zone. All right, you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.